I'm packing an order. So I didn't get the marketing email set up last night. All right, so website goes live at 6. It's editing me. Um, I realized that I didn't really have an appropriate intro for this vlog. So this vlog starts on September 1st. It was launch day. Um, there were a lot of points I forgot to record, like sometimes <laughs> explaining what we were doing. But um, there wasn't a lot to get right now um, because it, it was a slow launch and you'll see that in the video. But I, I got what I could, and we're moving on, we're pushing on, and the next vlog is really slow, but we'll talk about some of the next things we're doing. So, um, I just wanted to give you an intro, tell you what was going on, and enjoy watching. So, I didn't get the marketing email set up last night, so I just went to lunch, I set it up real quick, it's ready to go an hour before launch. Um, I already made the TikTok, so all I have to do is go on the computer and probably a few minutes to launch, I'm gonna go ahead and upload those, or right after I launch the website, I'm gonna go ahead and upload that to TikTok and Instagram and all that. So today's launch day, when my daughter gets home, um, and then I get off at five. Um, that gives us an hour just to do last minute things and we're good to go. All right, so website goes live at six. We got Gianna working on some last minute packing um, of a shirt that we uh, ended up not using for our model. And then she will be double checking our inventory counts. <music> For launch we're just a few minutes away so I got up to get ready to bring the two orders we got last night to the post office and we got another order I have a new puppy say hi Toby and he doesn't like being alone right now um, so he's gonna join us in the office to pack this order so, I don't have the best setup in this office for packing, so you're going to see a lot of this. That's okay. Um, so, let me go ahead and bring you to the computer and print off the packing slip. I'm packing an order. So, our first order is for... Melinda in Rhode Island and she is getting one of our music shirts in extra large. I have already filled out her card with our coupon code on it. Right. 
And let me go print out her shipping label. All right, thank you, Belinda, for being one of our first orders. All right, so this order is from Tasha here in Ocala. She's actually uh, one of the Girl Scout leaders in our service unit, and she got our Shine Journal. because she got just the journal we have the boxes for just the journal um, they do have the cardboard in there to keep it from going haywire I can't promise that it'll stay that way but that's what it is now um, I am going to additionally wrap this in some in a bag <laughs> I'm almost done, okay? Alright. Put this in the bag. Makes it a little more snug with the bag. Um, we also don't have a fancy dispenser yet for the tape. So, I'm gonna go wet the sponge so I can wet the tape. Uh, let's get the thank you card. I spelled her name right. Tasha. Tasha. Now these coupon codes um, that we give out are based on the next shirt that we want to release. So um, it's kind of a sneak peek on what the next shirt is without completely giving it away. So, there's her package. Let's go ahead and seal it. Because these we can ship right in here. There we go. And then we have room to put the shipping label right here. Um, one thing we did forget on the other packages is the thank you stickers. There are these purple stickers that we have printed. So I'm going to go ahead and add those to all packages now. And this one we'll just add um, to the bottom. We really need a thing to wet this. They're not that expensive. We just didn't get one because we didn't know how many boxes we would be using. So let me go ahead and print out the shipping label and this package will be ready to go. Got the shipping label. Ready to go. Thank you, Tasha. So it's September 3rd. 3rd. Um, we did launch. We only got three sales, um, but we knew it wasn't going to be this huge launch. We haven't taken off on social media. We did finally get the TikTok shop open, but we haven't placed any ads yet. So I'm considering doing that today. That way we can see where that takes us. Otherwise, um, right now we're going to be focusing on getting stuff to start doing craft fairs and craft markets, um, and that'll help spread the word, so at least locally, 
so we do have goals and we weren't too worried that we didn't get sales right away because we were being realistic and two of the people we knew and one of the people her dad knew so um right now i am just editing a reel i have been slacking on reels but i'm think i'm gonna scratch what i had right now and i'm gonna edit the reel um packing our first order which was her aunt um and that way you know show that we're actively in business now other than the one announcing we were in business so i'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'm going to look and see how much money I want to spend for the TikTok shop to run an ad. Hello. Um, so it is, what day is it? Oh, September 8th. It's Friday. Um, we haven't recorded much since launch. We got a few sales. Um, not too many, but... We weren't expecting that many, as I said in the last vlog. Um, we know that right now our only advertising, advertisement was close friends and um, social media. And we started from zero on social media. So we knew it wasn't going to be a huge launch. We do have some people who are still going to order. They just couldn't order right now. Um, and, you know, um, I did fall off from making like TikToks and stuff since the launch just because I've been busy. We're coming into busy season personally. Um, so it was kind of a, a slow time, to, or not slow, but busy time for us to, you know, split our attention between things. Um, right now I'm just in bed um, kind of planning out other another business stuff that I am going to start since this business is technically for my daughter. So when she's fully trained, she's going to take it over. I can finally um, launch my business, but I'm going to have everything planned and everything ahead of time so I can just make and go. It's going to be mo mostly handmade still, um, unless we get so big that we have to outsource a lot of it. Um... I am planning on tomorrow, we're going to Hollow Scream at Bush Gardens tomorrow. So I'm planning before tomorrow, <coughs> sorry, not before tomorrow, but tomorrow morning to at least start to put together some TikToks. Um, we're going to do a TikTok for each product um, just to highlight our products and show off what we got. We are also planning two types of different products right now for the two collections that are existing that will launch sometime between October and November, probably November. Um, and then we want to learn, launch a new shirt. We're only going to have five of each size for those shirts because sales are slow right now. We don't want to overbuy and get stuck with all this merchandise. So we had 10-ish of our other ones, but we're going to have five each of those. And if they sell well, we can always restock and get more. Um, but we already have a, the design picked out. We just have to draw it up. Um, we're trying to add something more than just words. Like, you know, our Shine Through the Dark had the light bulb and the music is my therapy. The music was, um, was spelt with music symbols and notes. So we wanted to kind of continue with that um, and maybe down the line later add photo versions inspired by each of those sayings um, we want to hire a local artist um, or one of our friends that loves art um, to maybe draw those up I'm not beyond using AI if I get it from a source that allows you to use it commercially um, but it has to be the right image because they don't, um, I was just playing around with some AI generators, just random ones, and they didn't quite get the feel of what I wanted, except one of them. Um, so that's where we are with that. Uh, right now, I just have to figure out what I want to do with each of these product TikToks. I know introducing the products, talking about the products, stuff you can find out on the website in the description, but I want you to be able to hear it, see the product, uh, while I'm interacting with the product, um, just so 
you you know really what it looks like and not just in pictures so that's my idea I'll be working on that this week because I got to start getting more TikToks out I can't neglect social media if we expect to grow any um, other than that I just am um, working on other business stuff right now um, and then going to bed I have to run an errand go pick up something I need in the morning um, because I have this little coffin bag I made that I'm going to use but it's really small and I don't want to bring my whole wallet so I want to bring some get something to hold my cards in and put it in there so and then we have hollow scrim that night so somewhere in between is when I'll be working on business stuff so um that is about it right now I just wanted to update y'all because I don't want to get to the end of next week um and then not have any video and you don't know why um it's just because it was a slow launch and it takes time to build up what you see on these other tiktokers accounts or youtubers it, it takes time to build that up um we didn't go in with a huge following we started posting social media back in june and it is september but um without having a website at the time that people could physically go look at it was hard and I don't want to repost all these videos that I already posted because they were about preparing for launch whereas now we're launched we're not making another new product we're actually the two that products that we have that we're going to use for each line we're not making we're buying and um, we have the money to buy it now but we just want to wait I uh, know um a couple a couple weeks before we purchase them just so we have um, extra money put into the business that we're investing from our income um, from our regular jobs so um, we're still pushing forward if you guys want to see anything specifically in the video um, or in our YouTube videos or TikToks or whatever just let us know and we will try and cover that and any other questions you might have um, Hopefully I have more to record this week. I will let you know. Um, until then, though, have a great day and we'll see you whatever I'm doing next. So it's September 13th. It's almost two weeks in. Um, no, we haven't filmed a lot. We haven't got a lot of orders, but we just got another order and I'm going to pack it. I was going to have to on a packet and pack it on camera, but um, this is what we're working with. Right now, we got stuff all over the floor. Um, because we're having a yard sale this weekend, finally. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and pack the order. And this order is from... Well, I don't have it in front of me because it was on my phone. Be right back. Pramesh, and I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. In Massachusetts, uh, Shine Through the Dark Water Bottle on today but we just got another order from andy in virginia and he got a shine through the dark drawstring bag um again i would have gianna on this video um but she came home from school sick she's got makeup work because she was out sick the last couple of days and she's just got a lot to do right now so i'm helping her out um but she is going to slowly start taking over i was showing her how to print the labels and everything so um, she is slowly going to start taking over now. This is her business. I have plans for another one that I can't start on until she can function on this one. So let's go ahead and pack the order for Andy. That's it. That's all she wrote. Um, yeah, it was a very short vlog, and I, I, I realized that. Um, we did get some other packing and stuff on TikToks that we posted. We just, we had a lot going on. Um, and even now I'm editing this a week and a half later and we have a concert coming up. Um, and then the next week we have a hoarder convention and then another concert. And then, um, we're either doing Halloween Horror Nights or the SeaWorld version of Hollow Scream because we did the Bush Gardens one the opening weekend. Um, and then my daughter is going to the opening of Five Nights at Freddy's with her friends the next weekend. 
And she's supposed to have troop camping with her Girl Scout troop, but she's like, I'm busy. I just, I want to relax one weekend. I get it. So we're super busy coming up. And that's not even mentioning working on some of the things that we have planned. So, but we'll talk about that in the next video. Thank everyone for watching. Um, subscribe, like, it will help. Um, I know our videos are pretty um, not masterfully done, I should say, but this is just documenting our journey. We're not aspiring to be professional YouTubers, so we're working with what we got. <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and we will see you in two weeks on the next vlog. Bye.